Hello and welcome to Quantum IAS. In this video lecture, we are going to discuss the question that was posted on our portal on 4th December. One more thing. Uh, in the previous session, I have written the 4th of December. Kindly correct it to the 3rd December. Okay. Now, let us analyze this question. So, this is this question is also from previous year question. And this is a standard question. Wait. Uh, what you can say, it is from the mechanics unit or module. And in mechanics, it's directly from the conservation of energy. Okay. So in this series, we are doing uh, first all of the previous question. Then we will move to the some of the expected question that we can ask in the examination. Now, in this question, what are the keywords here? The forces acting on the particle are conservative. So conservative force is the keyword that we have to discuss here. So that the total energy of the particle, which is the sum of kinetic and potential energy is conserved, right? So we have to show that the total energy of the particle that is kinetic plus potential energy is conserved here. Right? So how will we start this question? So in the introduction section, we have to discuss one thing. conservative force so there are a lot of definition that are available for the conservative force or in many ways we can discuss discuss the conservative force but the best way to describe the conservative force is to discuss a force is said to be conservative said to be conservative If work done in a loop is zero. If the work done in a loop is zero, what does it mean? Let me give you a benefit idea. Suppose a particle move from one to two. So it go with this path and come with this path. Okay. So if the complete work done in this path is zero, then we can say that this force is what? Conservative in nature, right? Also, what you can discuss here, you can discuss about the kinetic energy. Is the energy to the virtue of its motion? Right, you can discuss about the potential energy, one line only. Right. That is virtue due to is configuration or you can say the position and you can you should discuss that that work done in a conservative sorry work done by a conservative force is stored in the potential energy of a system right after writing these things you should move to that you should use and you can use any of the uh, properties of conservative force i am writing here you can write in conclusion also properties of conservative force so there are a lot of the properties you can write about the conservative force right just we have written that uh, some of the kind of mechanical <coughs> sorry Mechanical energy is conserved, right? Also, curl of the conservative force is zero. Also, force can be written as the scalar, gradient of a scalar function, okay? Right, also work done by is what? Path independent, right? They are not uh, the path function, they are state function. You can write any of the th thing, but what we need to write that is must that is this thing because using this one we will move further so force can be written as the gradient of the scalar function right now if you wish to find a small work done we can write that f dot dr that is minus 
five dot dr right what is minus five so you can skip the calculation i am calculating just for your reference <coughs> so minus this is del phi by del x i cap plus del phi by del y j cap del phi by del z k cap dot what is dr it is simply dx i cap dy j cap and dz k cap so you will simply get uh, if you do the dot product d phi by dx into dx is simply what we can say that is equals to minus d phi okay or uh, let us consider this phi as u minus d u right let's assume phi is equals to u and what we call the potential energy of this system okay so dw is what minus dw is equals to minus minus du that what we have written here is the work done by the conservative force is stored in the potential energy of the system what is dw again uh, if we do the integration we can say that integration dw is what f dot dr vector is equals to integration du from initial to final okay and this is also from initial position to the final position so we can write force as m a mass into acceleration is m db by dt into dr right integration from uh, what you can say the initial position to the final position and again it is it will become what minus delta u right so it, it is if you integrate these things what will become u f minus u i minus okay so this is the thing what you can say okay so we can use uh, this one or you can use this one either right so what will this will become so it become m so you do need not to show all of the calculation you can do the calculation in the minimal time dv dot v okay from initial to final is equal to minus delta u So dv into d we can write as m half d into v dot v right it can be written as okay is equal to minus delta u from initial to final simply you can uh, keep this inside i to f it can become d into half mv square simply minus delta u and it can be written as half m vf whole square minus half m vi whole square is equal to minus delta u so this is basically uh, the change in kinetic energy delta t you can say delta t is equal to minus delta u uh, delta t plus delta u is equals to zero or you can say the delta e is equals to zero right the change in the kinetic energy is zero oh, sorry the change in the total energy is zero or you can say the energy is conserved right you can uh, write like delta e is zero is what ef minus ei is equals to zero that is ef is equals to ei and this is possible only when the force is what conservative nature and when we can write the net work done is equals to what change uh, change in the potential energy negative of the change in the potential energy so work done by conservative is what minus delta u we have proved this also okay so this much of the proof you need to do this okay so this is what you should write in the body part always remember most of you do what you should you do not do this derivation so you have to do the kinetic energy part also you have to prove this also that work done by this can be written as the potential energy of that scalar function right you can use either you can use phi as u from the beginning also right and then you can come to that conclusion so in the introduction part you should write the what do you mean conservative force kinetic energy potential energy and this word how work done by conservative force is related to the potential energy of the system in the conclusion part what you can write 
So you can write any of the real life example of energy conservation. You have a lot of example in the fluid dynamics itself. There are a lot of example in the fluid dynamics. There are a lot of example in the uh, what you can say uh, the gravitation right in the central force also. So also I would like to focus more on the central force here also because central force is given the uh, our syllabus and central force is what conservative in nature. So you can discuss about the sun and the earth system right how its energy is con uh, what you can say the conserve right what you can uh, also the sun is at the what one of the uh, focus of the ellipse okay this is the ellipse so this is earth so you can write right so here it travel faster right here it travels slower right these type of concept you can write also you can write the curl of the force is zero or you can write any of the uh, that work done by work done is path independent so you have lots of things to write these things okay so uh, you can write any of these uh, thing in your answer you can write also about the uh, elastic collision if you wish to add right elastic collision or you can add uh, uh, what you can say the spring system access chain simple harmonic motion you can write you can quote any of the example what you want to quote here but just you should what is necessary to add is the characteristics of conservative force or you can say conservative work so this is this is must this should be written in the conclusion also okay so uh, one more thing i would like to discuss here and i want to tell you guys that you should post your answer plus review answers of other so we are resuming these thing on weekdays okay so every monday to friday you will be getting question and the video solution okay most of the question are from the previous question but uh, if you will post the answer it will make the motivation for us okay so do post your answer review uh, answers of others so that we will make a very healthy community where each one grow okay thank you and have a nice day